throughout the, the town, there's been a number of different experiences. Um, getting to meet local people, eat amazing food, um, and have some beautiful interactions with people around the area have been very welcoming as well. Especially in all the places we go, everyone really, even though there is a language barrier there, there is some kind of understanding of, of a welcoming um, place. Um, look, yeah, the main differences um, between the Seca and, and Izu down here um, is, is really, like I said before, the cultural, cultural immersion you get. Um, the Seco is, is great for a first time visit to Japan, um, but yeah, the, the cultural experiences you get down here are just, yeah, you really feel like you're a part of um, well, the community, but a part of, of how the Japanese live um, in, in kind of a ski town or in, in you know, a kind of winter area. Also the food, the food here is, is amazing. There's not many places you, you know, as a Westerner you would come and you could experience really true, like true Japanese um, dishes. Um, it's, yeah, it's, it's like nothing I've experienced elsewhere in Japan. Uh, spending this short time, it was uh, learning about learning from the sensei about respect. Uh, it's only a little bit from what I've seen from the sensei, but uh, I feel like I've understand a little bit of the samurai spirit. Mm -hmm.